Hey guys, Holiday Master here, and um, so it's gonna be a little video. Um, well, I just now noticed my lights are all twisted up. That's nice. How lovely. I will have to get up there and fix that. <sighs> anyway, so this little video, um, reason number one on why I'm, I have not decorated for Christmas yet. Dad wanted to fertilize the lawn, like I said in one of my last videos. Yeah, well now we're up to nine inches of freaking snow. So, if this doesn't melt within the next day or two, I'm just gonna start decorating because I swear to God, if I come out and this ground's frozen and I don't get to put my Christmas stuff up, I'm going to be so ticked off. I'll just decorate in the summer. Put my, well, not really, but I'll put my uh, lights out and everything in the summer if I have to. Because I'm getting ticked off with this weather. Kind of with my dad, but I also understand where my dad's going. You know, with the whole fertilizer the yard thing. But this video, not about me complaining. It's about me testing my turkey birds and the snow. Shoot, I might have to go grab a flashlight. Dang it. I forgot the shovel over here today, and that's where their plugs are, so it's, uh, shoot. It's, it's going to be a little tricky. Oh, oh, there's a plug here. wonder what it's to. We'll find out. Yeah, it's to the turkeys. So you can, you guys can see they're, they're pretty covered up. I have a feeling Mr. Scarecrow here is. Oh, this Scarecrow is going to be so thin. Oh boy. <laughs> I don't like how this is going. Uh, I'm worried about these older turkeys too. Uh, they're going to be extremely thin. Yep, look at that. Oh dang, even the back of his head now too. He still stands up though. Yeah, I knew this one. I knew the scarecrow wasn't going to stand up. Now he actually did. Ha! Huh. Did not expect that at all. Honestly. Uh, I gotta get my gloves on, dang it. I just came out to get the snow off of him. <sighs> Funny part is, earlier with... The uh, Mickey there, I came out and put his fan underneath him for a reason. But, the wind ruined that too. Uh, problem right now, guys, it's not just uh, snowing and windy. It's freezing rain right now. That's why I came out and turned him on, because I didn't want him freezing and stuff. Because you saw how thin the scarecrow was. I don't want him getting any thinner, which I know it's gonna happen. Like, look at this. You can see straight through him. Actually, that's probably why he's standing up right now. The rain. Boy. Oh boy, oh boy. And this is why I wanted to decorate already. Mainly the lights, because I know the inflatables would have became thin. Yeah, I hate to say it, but I think this turkey shot. He's the only one of the two tall ones that 
has trouble standing up anymore. I mean, it doesn't surprise me at all. Now, their age. This one was kept in a shed for two or three years, not being used. So it makes sense that he's thin because, you know, the hot summer days really warm out. He's kind of standing up now. But yeah, guys. So, another kind of night review just now with 9, 10 inches of snow. <laughs> so, I'm happy they all did kind of good. But I know for a fact when I take them down, at least the scarecrow and that turkey... Uh, mainly the scarecrow but they're gonna be paper thin you know the area on that turkey that I noticed was the worst was his belt in the white boot area so that's probably gonna be a <laughs> fun trip but the scarecrow on the other hand oh there's just air rushing out of him I'm impressed he's even standing up right now honestly his whole head is that thin. Can't really tell on the camera because of the uh, um, light, but in person, it's he's he's just paper thin. So, yeah, guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I hope to be making Christmas videos soon. I have. Um, a 14 foot tall Mickey Mouse nutcracker that I got this year so yeah guys thanks for watching and peace out